Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. I'm glad to see you again. Yeah, thanks. Mario is there. Mario is there. Tisha, the 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 two two sentences. Come on. <laughs> oh man. I spent one hour letter by letter point really? for point. I'm not. I'm not. Oh, okay. Maybe when when the class is over, maybe. Okay, okay. It's a it's a simple detail that maybe you are missing. But as soon as you said you are going to say, it. my goodness. <laughs> by letter by letter. Even I, I restart the computer, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> oh. Pero dale, ahorita. Me contaste. En la mañana, es que en la mañana no pasé. Pero hice la de aquí para el defensa, en los cuatro minutos. Y ahí este, puse el café de la 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 Todo lo que estaba siempre en la tarde lo la de la de la de la de Como que te quita la energía, la de 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 la Sí, con un día un día no tal vez se cae bien claro me sostendré de un solo porque me va a hacer que te te deprimas o te pongas así de nervios no nervios Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. My goodness. <clears throat> it's going to be better with this life, I guess. Okay, I recommend that for today, um, take a pencil and a notebook and write down a lot of new words that you are going to learn. And at the same time, if you want, you can make a screenshot at the moment that, uh, that I explain it, because we have a lot of information related with the four piece. So please try to get all the info. If you study marketing, you are going to remember some tale. If not, you are going to have a, a, a new knowledge about marketing related with the four pieces and the strategies also that is going to help you in the future. Well, let me see how many people do I have, only 12. I don't know why I got only 12.
my bones. Uh, to make a switch here. Accesso di Nicaragua. Ok, I'm preparing the attendance list in order to have it ready. At the moment, all of you be ready. Ok, welcome, Saira, Ana Lilian, Mario, Adriana, Ana Beatriz, Carlos Antonio, Wendy. Jose Jonathan, a los que tienen cámaras apagadas, no los saludo, no sé si están ahí, no me van a oír. Hola, teacher. Ah, ahí está María Concepción. <ríe> ah, ok, Laura, welcome, Laura. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Misael Cañas is there too. It is uh, Escobar. Okay. okay um, let me see. Somebody else is there. Ah, Claudia, Claudia said too. Ana Maria that is trying to something, do something there. Okay, before you check up the attendance, um, Ana Maria is there. Welcome, welcome. Se me apagó otra vez. Elizabeth. Hello, Elizabeth. Hi, teacher. How are you? Nice, and you? Very good. More or less. More or less. Okay. Okay, remember what we uh, said uh, at the end of the class, okay? They uh, had the chance to share your ideas because we are going to continue talking about some strategies that uh, you are going to use at the moment that you are going to apply the four piece. But don't worry about it because we are going to have uh, the right time in order to talk about this. And as I told you before, uh, try to write down some words that maybe you don't know. And uh, if you want, you can make some screenshot at the same time that we are going to be talking about it in order that you can get uh, all the information. Para que les quede la información, por favor, les pido que tengan, eh, vayan haciendo su vocabulario, es muy importante. Eh, y también, uh, si se puede, ir haciendo como los screenshots de el material, porque a veces es kind of difficult to share it. A veces es como, como difícil el poder... Uh, Porque tiene enorme cantidad, you know. Okay, then I just sent him here. And 
to show you what we're going to talk about today. And based on that, you're going to have an idea. Let me see if you got it. Okay, this is video conference number seven, marketing vocabulary practice, and this is class seven. I'm going to check out the attendance first to start talking. But you already got uh, an idea because remember marketing vocabulary practice that give you an idea about what we are going to talk about. Okay, let me check out the things first. Hablemos primero de la asistencia. Okay, Adriana. Present. Adriana is there. Okay. Uh, Ana Beatriz. Present teacher. Ana Lilian. Ana. Present. Eh, Ana Mariela. Present teacher. Escobar. Present. Claudia. Present. Francis. Present teacher. Iris Ibet. Iris. Iris. No está. Ya llevo varias. Jonathan. Present, Mr. Lazo. Ahí está, ahí está Jonathan. Welcome, sir. Welcome, sir. Eh, Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos, Laura. Present teacher. Laura is there. Maria Concepcion. Present teacher. Eh, Maria Elena. Maria Elena. Maria Elena. No, no está. Mayra Veralice. Present teacher. Ahí está Mayra. Zaira Eliana. Zaira. Maybe in traffic. Jam. Eh, Marlene Larín. Present teacher. Santos Misael. Present teacher. Wendy Maribel. Present teacher. Jenny. Jenny, Sulaima, it's not here. Yesenia Lisette, no Jesse. Hey, Carlos Alberto, Mari Ernesto. Presentation. Okay, okay. Okay, let us talk about the last activity. Do you remember what we're talking about? Okay, I need to see the your presentation. Who wants to do it? Anybody? Ah, no le gusta dejar actividades para el siguiente día porque se les olvidan. Mm, I got it. We need to make a review about the previous class. Who wants to tell me what uh, did you learn in the previous class? And that way we are going to connect the information, the knowledge, with a new topic that we are going to study today. Just what you remember. You don't need to read any paper, any notes. Just what you got in your brain. What you remember, just tell me. We were talking about the four P's. Okay, okay. I remember that one of them was the 
product and okay. price. Pricing. Okay, what else? Somebody else, tell me. You already mentioned two, two piece. Are missing two, but you don't need to see any not. So what do you remember? Tell me. We got only two pieces and we miss it too. The last two teacher um seria price, um promotion, place and product. Uh okay, okay, okay. Place and, and product. Okay, thank you. Somebody else? Bien, y ahora no es lunes. Les creo lunes cuando dicen no, lunes is difficult. Today is Tuesday. We are talking about uh, also uh, customer service. What is the important customer service? Ah, ah, okay. Do you remember what I showed you at the beginning? We were talking about, and I show you some a, a presentation about that. Do you remember the topic? No, the topic. What the customer want? Ah, oh, okay. What the customer want or customer need? Okay, what can you tell me about somebody? Yesenia, we said, and Jenny and Yesenia are coming now. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good night, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, what else? Good evening, teacher. Welcome, Jenny. Okay, Good evening. Maria Elena is coming too. I am all right. Okay, thank you. I hope that all of you feel really well today. As I told them, and as I told you at the beginning, uh, we are going to continue talking about the same topic because now we are going to talk about some strategies that we need to use in the four piece. But before to start with the topic, we are making a kind of review about the previous class. And I'm asking, what do you remember about? You don't need to see or not uh, the book. No, what you, what you remember in your mind. Aha, uh -huh. I got you, I got you. <laughs> I am um, remember um we talk about the satisfaction of the clients. Okay, nice. What uh, else? What is the customers want? Careful, be careful. Okay, what else? I remember to share to find most important the team, the customer. Okay. Thank you, Samaria. 
we talk about the four piece product price placing promotion. Okay. You see, all of you got something that um, it's really important that you share it. And that way you are going to reinforce and stay in your brain. Okay, thank you. Let's start with the new material today. Don't forget what I told you, try to make your own vocabulary. And if you can do it, you can make a screenshot in order that you can keep all the information with you and you can study later on because you are going to need it, okay? Here we go. Okay, uh, before I show you the material, I'm going to ask you to participate uh, not only in reading, but also giving your ideas, your comments about what we are going to talk. And that way it's gonna be better because I don't want to be just reading all the information and you just listen. No, it's not that way. Quiero que por favor en la, en la presentación traten de participar, de dar sus ideas, sus comentarios relacionados a lo que vamos a hablar. Para que no se sienta así tedioso, aburrido, que solo el, el facilitador es el que habla y los demás solo oyen. Y cambiemos el precepto de la educación bancaria, por favor, porque eso ya quedó en el pasado. Okay. Okay, let me get bigger. I got my hand here. Okay. Okie dokie. Uh, as you said, yesterday we were talking about uh, the marketing mix and we talk about four piece, product, price, place, and promotion. Today we are going to clarify every term. And we are going to start saying that uh, when we talk about product, what we said about who wants to read the concept? Only one, please. A uh, product is anything that can be offered to a market that might satisfy a uh, want or need. Okay. In your own words, what can you tell me about? Pregunta general para todos. that might satisfy a one or need. If you can offer something, that means that you need to satisfy a need to, to somebody, right? That is what we call product. Continue, Maria, please. It can be um, physical, God, Phys physical, physical, yes. God, service information or ideas that is offered to the customer. Okay, what, what, what is uh, this line telling us? That means that we, we can have a different uh, product, right? Could be something physically, or uh, could be a service, could be information or ideas that is offered to the customer. But we need to have a clear concept about this. 
Because when, sometimes when we talk about product, we, we just think in something that we can touch, that we can see. For example, if I got this, this is a product, of course. This is physics because we, I can touch it, I can feel it, I can see it. But what about a service or information? It's a product. For example, I mean, our course is a service, is a product. Okay. Okay, I need that, that uh, you have a clear uh, understanding about every concept because at the end you are going to do something and you need to use all this concept. Okay, let, let, let's go then. Who wants to read it? My teacher, uh, the product function answer question like, what should our company make and sell? What do all customers want or need? Will customers buy our product service? Okay. As soon as you see the first question, what comes to your mind? ¿Qué se le viene a la mente desde el momento que ve la primera pregunta? General question. What should our company make in itself? What comes to your mind when you see this question? Or what our customer wants? Definitely a, a product and a market to, to, to gain a specific uh, product. For example, uh, I want to make a company of pencils. So uh, I have to uh, focus to to schools and uh, architects, maybe. Oh, okay. Okay, thank you. And you are going also to ask the last question. Will customer buy our product or service? Why? You need to answer that question. Why they are going to buy it? Because remember that the moment that you create a prototype, do you remember the words? Se recuerdan de esa palabra, cierto? Yes? Yes. Okay. Uh, at the moment that you create a prototype, you are going to uh, ask the question, will customer buy our product or service? And that way you are going to to create it because you, you need to be sure that you are going to resolve a need and in that way you are going to get success. Okay, somebody else wants to read or Okay, in Espanol, uh, tengo más de 15 personas. Eh, les he pedido que por favor cada uno cuando considere conveniente participe para que no se me duerman eh, para que nos mantengamos activos no se preocupe por eh, que se va a equivocar de los errores vamos aprendiendo así es que tranquilo pero trate de participar por favor ok who wants to read it? Me teacher. Okay. Will product and service development takes into account quality, quality design, feature, and benefits? Ah, oh, okay. 
That means that we need to take into account these uh, four characteristics. Quality, design, features, and benefit. And maybe we can ask some questions at the moment that we are going to talk about quality. Um, at the moment that we are going to talk about design, some uh, special feature and some benefits that the customer are going to have at the moment that they buy the product. Okay, let us talk about quality. Who say me? Who say me? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. And quality. Simple put is you improve the quality uh, of your product, you will attract more customers. Ah, okay. What are the keywords here in order to attract more customers? The key words, las palabras claves, right here, in order to attract more customers. Mm. Tell me, somebody. Hello, hello. What are the key words in order to attract more customers? Tell me. Improve the quality. Ah, okay. Improve the quality. And that way you are going to attract more, more customers, right? Try to keep in mind, please. Somebody else. Me, teacher. Okay. Wendy. Wendy. Design. Every product has a design component. We often buy one product instead of another because we like the way it looks. Okay. Somebody want to explain this? When we talk about design, in your own words, tell me. In your, or your own words, in sus propias palabras. Me, teacher. Okay. Uh, the design maybe refers to the color, the shape, the size of the product. Okay, excellent. And remember, every product has a design component. And every brand has uh, its own design. Like uh, if we are going to talk about Coca-Cola, for example, uh, Pepsi, they have uh, their own design. And all different brands. Okay, but let us see the next one, please. Okay. Somebody else? Future product developers consider the future of product such as the material used in, in construction, the extent, the size, or the basis. Oh, okay, when we talk about future, uh, we are talking about uh, a special characteristics like uh, the material that we are going to use in order to, to build that product, the sense, the sight, or the taste of the product, all depend what kind of product we are talking about. And what, I'm, I, what I was telling you at the beginning is that, for example, um, that you, you need to take into account, for example, all these kind of words, Si ya las conocen, mucho que mejor, pero si no, eh, 
es necesario como ir tomando nota de ellas o ir haciendo como la screenshot para, eh, recordemos que el tema de hoy es relacionado al vocabulario, ¿sí? Entonces hay muchas palabras muy importantes dentro de all these crosses. Ok. Ok, what about benefits? Who wants to read it? Benefits. People buy most products and services for a particular purse and benefits. Each product on service has benefits that attracts different customers. Okay, people buy most products and services for a particular purpose and benefits. Each product or service has benefits that attract different customers. What does mean? Who wants to tell me something about this? The real meaning of this paragraph. Take a look at the, uh, in the period, after the period. Each product or service has benefit that attracts different customers. Okay. Yes, teacher. Because uh, the customer needs different, uh, different character characteristics. Okay. For example, uh, a cell phone, maybe I need, Capacity, capacity, and other customer need a camera, a good camera, for example. Okay. Excellent. Okay, let us continue then. We already talked about the problem. Let's talk now about price. Somebody else. Price. The price refers to what a customer is being asked to pay for a product or service. Okay. Let me try to get the list of your name because I need to, I need to all of you. Okay, uh, when we talk about price, uh, refer to what the customer is being asked to pay for a product or service. Okay, that is really clear. But right here, also we are going to see how we are going to calculate the price that somebody needs to pay. Okay, who wants to get it? Hey teacher, the price the function and request on like, what are customers willing to pay for this product? What did this cost to product this product? How much profit do we want to make? Okay. 
And we need to take into account the answer of the question, what are customers willing to pay for this product? Willing, what is that? Customer willing, what is that? What does willing mean? Uh, willing is something that you wish. Oh, okay. Or? Need? Mm. Yeah, could be too. Because we is como ready. Mm. Yeah, could be too. But take a look at the question. What are customers willing to pay for this product? To be able to do something that is that is willing. To be able to do something. Depend the quality of the product. Okay, and, and the second question said, what did it cost us to produce this product? The company need to ask this question too. And also how much profit do we want to make? Do you understand all those questions? Maybe, maybe willing is be happy to do for something. Mm, yeah, could be in that way. I got the name here. I already got the list because I need the, I need that all of you participate. I got it. Okay. For well, the next one, I'm going to I'm going to say the name. But okay, price and decision can make the difference between a successful product and a failure. Price and decision can make the difference between a successful product and a failure. We need to, to be very careful at the moment that we are going to assign a price of a product because uh, based on that, it's going it's to be what we are going to get. Okay, let me see who's going to be the person in charge to read this. What about Marcela? Will you read it, please? Ana Marcela. Are you there? No, it's not there. No, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I got the wrong list, I guess. My goodness, I need to switch it, okay. Okay, who wants to read it? The Escobar teacher. Pricing. Okay, Escobar. Pricing. Cost is how much your hand to pay to purchase product or make the product you are selling. Price. On the other hand, is how much you are ch charging the customer for your product. Okay. Okay, but, but, but we need to take into account these uh, two words in yellow. Cost is how much you have to pay to push, produce and make the product you are selling. Okay, remember that. And the price, on the other hand, is how much you are charging to the customer for your product. Cost and price different, it's not the same. 
And I need that you understand it. El costo es una cosa y el precio es otra. Ok. Ok, the difference between your price and your cost is your profits. And also we got price less cost is equal to profits. Can, can you understand this, this, this formula? Entendemos la formula, la ecuación? Yes, mister. Ok, maybe tal vez alguien por ahí tenga dudas. Sí, necesito que todos comprendan. Price less cost equal to profit. Okay, let's continue then. Okay, um, we are going to talk also about breaking even. Breaking even. This is a new term that you need to, to have in your vocabulary. You, if you already have it, um, nice for you. But if you don't have it, um, I invite you to write it down and try to keep it there because you are going to use it. Your uh, breaking even point is the point at which your total sales equal your total costs. At this point, you are not losing money or making money. You are breaking even. Okay, wh wh what is the meaning? Of this fraction, break even. The cost to the price is the same. Yeah, it could be. Somebody have a, a, a doubt about the expression? What do we say in Spanish? Punto de equilibrio. Excuse me? Punto de equilibrio. Okay, okay. Y en buen salvadoreño, ¿qué significaría el punto de equilibrio? Estamos tablas, no hay ganancia ni pérdidas. Ah, ok. Término coloquial, tablas. <ríe> ok. Thank you, Escobar. Okay, that is the, the break in the Okay, ese, ese es el término. Por favor, tenganlo en cuenta. Okay, uh, there is a simple formula that can be used to calculate your break in the point. That is total cost divided to the price and equal to say the, the break in the point. I don't know if you got, uh, you got the formula. The total cost divided with price, and then you are going to get a breaking point. Is that clear? Yes or no? Okay, I'm going to give you some examples. Take a look at it, please. Okay, let me know something here, not if you see it very well. Okay, let's say Sally is planning to sell homemade chocolate pops at craft shows and trade uh, fairs as part of her small business idea. She has calculated that the cost of supplies and equipment to produce 1,000 chocolate pops is $2,000. If she's planning to charge 2.50 uh, then for each chocolate of how many does she have to sell just to break even? Okay, tell me. Try to use the formula and you are going to give me an answer about that. The 
if you got the formula, you are going to be able to give the answer. 8,000 unities. Mm, be careful with the numbers. Be careful. Check out again. Check out again, please. Revíselo otra vez, por favor. Somebody else, somebody else. Do you remember the formula? Eight hundred pallets, teacher. Eight hundred. Ah, eight hundred or eight thousand? Eight hundred. Hundred. Do you agree, Escobar? Do you agree, Escobar? Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay, answer. This is the answer. We got two thousand dollar divided. Um in the chart that we are going to put that is going to be uh, 2.50 is equal to 800 chocolate pots. That mean uh, 2000 is the total cost divided by 2.50 that is the price per unit and then we are going to get the uh, the, the, the BEP. Okay. Is that clear? Yes. To all of you, to all of you. Si alguien tiene una consulta, por favor, a este punto todavía podemos. Porque necesito que manejemos la forma. No question? I can hear you. Nothing. Okay, I know you are expert about this. Okay, here we go. Let us continue. Okay, if... Um, Is Sally sell all of her chocolate pops? And we are talking that uh, is uh, 1,000. How much profit will she make? Okay, tell me. Thinking that she's going to sell all the product, how much profit will she make? How we are going to calculate it? $500. Uh -huh. $500, okay. Yes, $500. Mm, could you tell me how do you, how do you get the result? How do you get the result? Tell me. 500 Okay, but I need to to tell you explain me the process in order to get the the, the answer. Uh. Tell me. Hello. Share I. <laughs> I got the answer because you don't want to tell me. What you are going to do is that um, you are going to look for the amount of product and then you are going to um, you are going to, 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 to take out the number that you got in the previous formula that in this case is 800 and you are going to multiply by the, the profit that you want to have, that in this case is uh, 2.50. And you are going to get 
500. Okay, and you got here 1000 minus uh, 800 is equal to profitable chocolate pop. Okay, multiply by 2.5, that is the price per unit, and then you are going to get the equal profits. Make an screenshot, please. Teacher, um, según la fórmula sería eh, 1,000 multiply for 2.57, eh, eh, 2,500 uh, less cost. Okay. Uh, that is uh, two two thousand equal a uh, five hundred. Okay. But is in another word, um, what you are telling me is it the um, well, you got the same answer, right? Is that right? Yes. Okay, because uh, don't get confused. No, no nos confundamos, porque en la previa, eh, the formula that we got here is just, this one is just to get what? Esta no sirve para obtener qué cosa, esta fórmula. Uh, cantidad de productos. Ok, no nos no vayamos a, a confundir, por favor, porque necesito que tengamos muy claro lo que ya vimos que era. Ok, hold on, hold on. La, this is the formula to, to get the breaking even. Ok. This one. And then we got the next one. This is the example that we have. As soon as you get this, you need to see um, how much the profit will make. And then you are going to apply this one. It's quite easy. It's just that you take, in, uh, take care of all, every number that we are going to have there. Okay, but let us continue then. Okay, let us talk now about um, the pricing. And also let us talk about strategies. But let me see the time uh, uh, because I need to check out the attendance too. Okay, if your objective is to make a profit, then you will need to determine a pricing strategy. You need to have really clear that you need to have strategies in this and how you are going to make money. Okay, um, let me see here. Okay, before to go to the next one, uh, I would like to check out the attendance. Antes de ir a la siguiente, me gustaría revisar la asistencia. Hasta ahorita todo claro, ¿sí? Yes, sí. Pero a los demás los, no los oigo, lo siento así callados, se me durmieron, ¿qué pasará? I don't know. Okay, Adriana. Perfect. Ana Beatriz. Present. Ana Lilian. Present. Ana Mariela. 
Present. Estuar. Present. Eh, Claudia. Present. Francis. Present teacher. Iris. Iris, Ivette. Now here. Jose Jonathan. Present. Juan Carlos Rivas. Juan Carlos. Laura. Present teacher. María Concepción. Present. María Elena. Present teacher. Mayra Beralice. Present teacher. Zaira Eliana. Zaira, Zaira. Zaira Marlene. Present teacher. Santos Misael. Present teacher. Wendy. Present teacher. Jenny. Present teacher. Yesenia. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto. Present. Y eh, Mario Ernesto. Present teacher. Okay, let us continue talking about this topic. Let me see where I got it. Okay, let us continue talking about this. Hold on a second, hold on a second. Okay, let us continue talking then because uh, we need to we need to talk about place. Okay, somebody else wants to read it, please. Place. Place refers to getting the product or service to this customer. Two things to consider when we talk about place. The physical location of where you are going to sell and the channel of distribution. Okay, um, in this stage, what we need to take into account is uh, two uh, important aspects, the physical location and the channel that you are going to use in order to distribute uh, your product. I guess it's really clear. Okay, the play function answer question like, will the product be sold locally, internationally, or globally? Will I sell the product online, in a store, in a catalog? Where will I locate my store? If you have cleared this question, everything is going to be nice, but you need to take care of this question. At the moment that we are going to talk about place, you need to take into account these three questions, okay? I'm going to press a little bit the list because, okay, place, uh, place strategy. 
plays a strategy in both how you will deliver your goods and services to your customer. Okay. It includes the movement of your product to both your location and to your customer. What does mean? ¿Qué significa eso? Hello. Hello. Or maybe it is so clear for that reason you don't want to talk, okay? I'm going to think that. Okay, I'm going to continue. Where and how the product will be distributed and sold in the marketplace in order to get into the hands of your customer. Okay, uh, in another question, you need, to, you need to have very clear. If you are going to sell something, how you are going to do in order to um, carry all the product into the place that you are going to be and how you are going to distribute and sell uh, this product in order to get into the hands of your customer. Are you going just to stay in your shop or you are going to, to sell it by uh, online and you are going to send it? You need to, to know everything about channel of distributions. Okay, somebody wants to read it? Channel of distribution. Channel of distribution are the paths of the ownership that good good for following as the path from the producer to the customer. Consumer. Okay. They, uh, they are the methods that a business use to sell and the distribution of this product. A uh, typical model. Manufacturing was was less seller. Rectangle. Also. I final G. All right. Okay. I, I mean that we make a stop here because right here also you are going to find out some new words maybe for you. And you need to take into account and, and, and put it in your vocabulary. Yeah, talking about ownership, maybe. Yeah, you already got what is the meaning? Goods. Producer, consumer. And when we talk about channel or distribution, they are the method that a business uses to sell and distribute its product. Typical model is this. The manufacturer, then uh, the wholesaler. Do you know what is this? Wholesaler. Mayorista. Yes, that's fair. And what about the retailer? What is retailer? Minorista. Okay, and the fi final user that is going to be the customer. Okay, try to keep in mind all those terms. Uh, tratemos de mantener esos términos, por favor, en, en cuenta. Okay, we got uh, direct distribution. Produce sell directly to consumer without any middle, uh, middleman involved. What, what is the meaning of that? What do you got about this?
And right here, you can see the producer and then it's going to the consumer. <clears throat> and the key word is this, the producer sell directly to consumer without any middleman involved. What, what is the meaning of this? This is another word that I need that you have it with you. Intermediario teacher. Intermediario. Share microphone. Goodness. Okay, now let us talk about indirect one step distribution. What's going on here? Let me see what's happened. Okay, now here is different because uh, the producer it is in contact with a retailer and then consumer. What is missing here in like in the previous? What well, what is the difference entre directo e indirecto? The difference is uh, a third person involved in, in the in distribution. Ah, okay. Okay, let us talk about physical location. Place also refer to the actual location and where you will be selling your products, selecting the right location for an accommodate, accommodating your business is one of the most important decisions when you get in a startup. You need to consider what we need to consider. The target market, competition, and traffic pattern. I need that you have here uh, these three terms. If you have it, um, it's going to be better, okay? And of course, you need to know that you are going to have some competition in the market. But at the same time, you need to know the traffic pattern that you are going to follow to distribute your product. And how you design your location can have a huge influence on your success. That means that you need to, to have a clear, I, I don't know if you have seen in the, in the, the, the moment that you have visited the, the Pizza Hut and they had delivered, they got a map. And then um, what they do is just to check the point, the specific point where, where they need to send something. Of course, right now, everything is digital and maybe they have got it in their, their cell phones, but it's necessary to have uh, the control of everything, the traffic pattern. Okay, let's, let's continue talking about the promotion, how we are going to do when we talk about promotion. Okay, promotion is the activity of communicating with the customer in order to increase sales. It includes every method used in getting the attention of customer to make them aware of a brand, product, or a company. That is the promotion and also uh, could be in, a, in different ways. 
Okay, I need uh, somebody help me to read this. Hello. Me, teacher. Okay, thank most, you. Most people associate um, adversity with promotion. However, promotion is more than that. Okay, the promotion. Okay. Okay, only the, only the only the word, only this word. Mm -hmm. Advertising. Advertising. Okay, repeat again. Advertising. Advertising. Okay, thank you. Continue. The promotion function answers questions like what message do we want to send to our customer? What is the best media to use to communicate with our customers? And uh, how can we make our product service stand out from the compet competition? Okay. Competition. Right here, what I need that you understand very clear is that, that this word, stand out. What is that? Stand out from the competition. What is that? Stand out, somebody. Como sobresalir, teacher. Okay. How you are going to succeed from the competition. Okay, thank you, Adriana. And also we need to have some objective to give information, to increase demand for a particular product to increase sales, to develop customer loyalty, promotional message. Uh, messages are designed to inform, persuade, and remain customers. You need to have everything clear. Okay, uh, what about the promotional mix? Okay, who wants to read it? Hey, teacher. Okay, thank you. The promotional mix is used as a tool in marketing to deter, determine, determine. Yes, that's right. Determine the best way to get the product or service to a particular market, understanding your audience and being creative in order to capture their attention. Arcade to successfully promote promoting a product or service. Okay, thank you. The promotional mix it is used uh, as a tool marketing to determine the best ways to get the product or service to a particular market. Understanding your audience has been created in order to capture their attention are key to successfully promoting a product or service. That is what we talk about promotional mix. Yeah, we need to, to make some, some strategies. And you can see it right here, the promotional mix, advertising, uh, direct marketing, self-promotion, publicity, uh, and personal selling, you know? How many, uh, aspect we need to consider when we are talking about promotional mix? Tell me. Five. Yeah, we are talking about five different aspects. And we are going to start with advertising. Okay, the volunteer who wants to read it, please? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. Albert, advertising. Any fine for of non personal com communication about a business product or service to types of advice and team bring media new paper, new papers, ma magazine, direct gym, direct mail, outdoor billboards, transit, and so buses or subway. Okay. 
Continue. Broadcast media, radio, television, in a red well cities. Website. Teacher Website. 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 Teacher is correct in the red. I listening in the new in the uh -huh, new noticias se dice new verdad. News, news. In in the news the presentation says in the red. My internet. In internet. internet. Uh huh. Internet. Is correct. Internet. Yes, Oscar is correct. American uh, pronunciation is our internet website. Mm. Instead of say internet, well, but all depend on the, the the area. But we we say internet. Yes, we we used to say that, but in in my case, I say internet. Mm. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Okay, right here we have a different uh, ways of advertising. We have two types of advertising, free media and broadcast media. And I guess that you already got uh, the meaning of both of them, right? Okay, let us continue then. Okay, we got direct marketing. Uh, let, let me see. Hold on, hold on. Okay, where businesses communicate directly with target customer uh, to generate a response and or a transaction, catalog, infomercial, uh, direct mailing, etc. Okay, right here, maybe the words that you don't have any idea could be infomercial. Somebody wants to tell me. Sounds anonymous, infomercial. As a TV offers. Ah, okay, something like that. It's a good example. That is what we call infomercial. Okay, sell promotional uh, promotion. All item for for ten dollar, or maybe buy one get uh, one and a half off everything. There is a store that used to have something like the last one. Do you know the name of the store? Or maybe there are a lot of stores here in Salvador that they say buy one and get uh, the second one at half price. Teacher, sometimes in playlists. Ah, okay, okay. And, and what else? Different areas like uh, Lichus and Adobe sometimes. And in the pier, boutique. Okay, D different in different places. Okay, marketing activities that provide extra value for incentive to the cost, the consumer price incentive, bonus size, for example, coupon off, contents, special event, etc. That that is what we call self promotion. Okay, what about publicity? The placement of a newsworthy item, a uh, newsworthy item about a business, new product, or employees in the media to attract uh, public interest. It is not paid for by the business. Whereas advertising is not, this can be positive or negative publicity. You need to be really careful about this. If you don't know the meaning of the word, newsworthy you need to look for it because um and that way you are going to have a, uh, a better idea the placement of newsworthy item about a business new product or employees in the media to attract public interest it is not paid for 
by the business we realize advertising is. Give me an example of this one, please. For example, the ads that we can find um, on the street. Yeah, in the electrical electrical pole. En los postes de electricidad. They speak there. And the walls in different places. Okay, so but some type could be positive or some type could be negative. We need to be careful about that. And we got some example here, but because of the time, let me run a little bit because um, we need we, need, we have some uh, more activities. Okay, what about when we talk about personal selling, a form uh, of person to person communication in which a seller attempts to persuade prospective buyer to push a company's product, service, or idea. Example for this. Just one example, no more than the one. I don't know, but I am remember um, a seller, her name, his name, Don Justo. He's a person, um, he come my home, my house, and bullying um, my grandma, uh, wherever, cualquier cosa, eso quizás. Okay, person selling. Yeah, the, a lot of people are selling different items right here in El Salvador. Teacher. Like hammock, shares, different. Okay, tell me. Could be, um, uh, Este, Avon y esas cosas. Mm, yes, los que could, be, could be in that in that way too. But uh, yes, you are using a catalog and, and something like that. But in this case, for example, uh, also you have uh, the product with you. Like the one that are selling the hammocks, los que andan vendiendo hamacas, sillas, y todo eso. Yeah? It's a clear example. I don't know in your areas, but right here is something like that. Okay, also, we are going to remember advertising, uh, yeah. direct marketing, self promotion, publicity, and personal selling. Okay, let me see. I guess uh, you already got uh, some ideas about this. Let's talk about a little bit about branding because you need to do something else. Branding is the name, term, design, symbol, or any other feature that identify your product. Goods or service as different from those of other products or companies in the markets. Okay, take a look at the, at the brand. A brand name is a word or a group of words that are spoken to identify a product or organization like Nike, you know? A logo is a symbol that identifies a company or organization, serves as a visual reminder to customer. As soon as you see this symbol, you say, uh, this is Nike, right? Okay, a, a slogan is a short, catchy phrase that helps a consumer to remember a product being advertised. A, a slogan is a short attention craving phrase used to advertise a product a good slogan should be memorable. Yeah, just do it. Belong to Nike, right? And try to remember this. I need that you tell me. Say money, live better. Belong to? Hello? It's Walmart. Walmart say, say money, live better. I don't know right here in El Salvador, but in another country, they, they used to have it. Okay, just do it. This is Nike. 
Ah, Nike, Nike, okay, 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 okay. Taste the rainbow. What is that? Maybe it's difficult for you. Mosquito. Do you know what is a mosquito? No? Yes, cannabis. Ah, okay, mosquito. Oh, keeps going and going and going. Belongs to which company? No idea. No idea. Okay, energy issue. Take a look. They're great. What we are what we are talking about. Kellogg's Frosty Flake. I'm loving it. McDonald's. <laughs> ah, bingo. Solo y desayuna, Claudio, por eso es. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it gives you wins. It gives you wins. Red Bull. <clears throat> Be careful with Red Bull. <laughs> okay. Um, maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's Maybelline. Maybelline. Soon, soon. What about that? No? Mazda. Because you are worth it. L'Oreal. Eat fresh. Sorry. Okay, uh, well, I guess uh, we are going to stop here because you need to do something now, I'm sorry, because of the time. Um, but uh, yes, if you were, your logo design should be designed to communicate the message you hope to get across your target markets. And, well, we got fed it. Amazon, Pinterest, Leto, the Francais, LG, Baskin, and so on. Okay, let me make a stop here because I've been talking a lot and you don't want to talk with me. And, well, I've been talking the whole day, you know. And for that reason, I ask you to participate. But you say, no, 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 I don't want to talk. Okay, based on all the information that I have shared with you, you are going to um, do the following. Let me see the time that we got. Okay, I guess we have time to do it. Okay, I invite you to go to page number 18 in your material. If you don't got it, I'm going to show you. Si no lo tiene, yo se lo muestro. In fact, I need to drink somewhere because I've been talking a lot. Okay, the first thing that you need to do is just to resolve exercise number four. The marketing mix can be divided into four groups or variable commonly known as the four piece product, price, place, the distribution, and promotion. Match the four piece to their description, and then you are going to check your answer. I need that you work on it, uh, but maybe because of the time, uh, you are going to resolve because you already got all the info. And right here on number five, what you are going to do, but, but let's do the, the first one because I, I would like to be sure that you are doing well right here. I'm going to give you like three minutes in order to resolve it. You got product, price, place, and promotion. Try to look for uh, the definition of each word, please.
I'm going to get somewhere because I go there's the map. I'm sorry. Okay, if you have it, just tell me, please. Number one. The number one uh, product. Product okay. is the merchandise or service offered by a company to its customer. Okay, Bingo, thank you. Number two. Number two price is the amount of money by the customer to purchase the product. Okay, thank you. The amount of money paid by customer to push the product. Okay, number three. Place. The activities that make the product available to consumers. And the promotion? The activities, the activities that communicate your product feature and benefits that, that help persuade customers to, to purchase the product. Okay. Okay, I guess it, everything is clear there. Right here, number five, uh, you are going to solve it. Each of the four pieces has its own tool to contribute to the marketing mix. The following word had, had to do with this tool, classify them into the right piece. Okay, but you are going to do that later on. What I want, and I got 20 minutes to do this, is the activity number six. You are going to work in group and you are going to choose a brand new national product or service. You already have it. And you are going to identify the product or the service elements that correspond to the four piece of the marketing strategy. I don't know if, if it is clear what, what I want. And then you are going to share it. You are going to share your analysis with the, the class. Of course, you already got the product, right? But, uh, but I need that you identify the products element that correspond to the four piece for the marketing strategy. Is that possible? Yes or no? Tell me. Hello. No, 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 I'm going to stop sharing because I need to see your faces. Okay, pero el problema que tenemos es que siempre los mismos grupos son los que hacen las presentaciones. Los demás no quieren hacerlas. Entonces, los que no las hacen van a aprender menos. Y los que las hacen van a aprender más. Okay. Recapitulando, ¿qué dice la instrucción en español para que alguien eh, comprenda? 
Somebody want to tell it? Mi teacher. Dice que escojamos un producto nacional o servicio reconocido. Ok. Identificamos el producto o servicio y los elementos que corresponden a las cuatro PIS de marketing, de estrategia de marketing. Ok. Ok, y ahí ya tenemos un avance porque el producto algunos ya lo tienen. Entonces solo sería de identificar eh, las cuatro PIS, las estrategias de cada uno de ellos. Así es que, here we go. I got 20. Any questions so far, right here? Alguna pregunta? No. Cualquier producto. Yes, no matter. Okay, try try to try to do it. Um, I'm going to give you like uh, seven minutes to do this because you already got some info. Here we go. Teacher, Hello? again, I uh, have two dispositives. You can move it, uh, group two. Maria, mm, Maria. <laughs> es que en uno oigo y en el otro no. Y en el otro es muy chiquito para verlo. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Elizabeth and Wendy. Bueno, el que habíamos estado a diseñar para todo era un serial, un serial familiar, algo así. Es el que estábamos a diseñar en todos los grupos, pero ahí vea. Va, pero salvadoreño, como oh, que algo de... no es salvadoreño. Okay. Salvadoreño, salvadoreño. Lido, tal vez. Lido. Yo de Lido no me olvido. Ahí está, ok, ok, ok. 
Nice. <laughs> work, work on it. Work on it. But the hurry up because we have a short time. Tenemos poco tiempo. Si es que identifiquemos Meterle. las estrategias para cada té, por favor. Ok. Ok, teacher. Ok. Okay, es el teacher. teacher. Sí, eh, además de eso tengo otro problemita. Solo puedo abrir en este teléfono PDF. No puedo abrir el archivo que usted me acaba de enviar. Ahorita veo. Me dice PDF. Vale. Se lo voy a mandar en PDF. Ok. Eh, si gustan, yo puedo decir la... La verdad que poquito. La uno, digo yo. Y alguien más que de las otras dos. Teacher, no lo escucho. Okay, hold on a little bit. I'm drinking a little water. <clears throat> okay, I'm here again. I got a sore throat because of winning. I've been talking a lot today, you know. But we are so close to finish. Okay. Let us see what you have. Who wants to share it? Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, ahí vamos. Let me see who is chatting. Bigger, please. Bigger, bigger, bigger. F4, F4. Or you can do it. Uh, No, you need to do it. Uh, en la parte de abajo hay eh, una vista. 
para poderlo hacer. Eh, no, eh, eh, da bueno, esa, esa. No, 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 la que tenía, la otra, esa. Ok. Juan Sutor. Our product is detergent. Detergent, okay. Yeah. Deeper, deeper, uh -huh. Tight, okay. The product are relational uh, design, packing it in brand name. Okay. For the price, personal sales, sales credit third, employment plant. Payment, payment plans, okay. For the place, retail location, transportation, and inventory. And the last name is the promotion, is public relation, discount, and advertising. Okay. Only that teacher. Okay, it's, 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 a, it's a general information, of course, okay. But don't worry, thank you very much. Cause of the time. Okay, somebody else. Quien más, quien más. I'm still waiting, I'm still waiting. Time is running, time is running. Okay, somebody else please. No, can you hear me? Yes, I got my microphone. No, say, oh, yeah. No, terminamos, teacher. Really? But the problem is that when I say, okay, you are going to do it the, the next day and say, yes, of course, we are going to do it. Pero cuando ya llega el próximo día, eh, nadie quiere. Nosotros sí, teacher. <laughs> ok, al menos uno más, uno más por hoy. In a brief way, de manera eh, concreta, para ver si comprendimos lo que estuvimos hablando. Time is running, time is running. Okay, uh, if you... Okay, Hi, here teacher. We here, here we go, here we go, Adriana. It's done. Hello? Oh, he's there, Coca-Cola. Hello. Okay, continue. Get Hello. Bigger. Get bigger, get bigger, get bigger, please. Okay, here we go. Um, we are gonna talk about Coca-Cola. Um, Product, uh, differential characteristic of the product come from tangible and attributes and intangible attributes. 
uh, incorporated directly in the liberation of the product. The, they are uh, um, the Coca-Cola recipe is highly secret and it forms the basis of which it's competitive. And the price, um, Coca-Cola follows a price discrimination strategy in its uh, marketing. This means that they uh, charge different prices for products in different segments. Okay. Uh, my co-workers, okay. <laughs> the price strategy is handled by clear expenses. This is the usual network. So Coca-Cola company manufacturing the derivative using its patterning parental formula and distributed to bottlers across the world. Okay, what else? This product can be found in particular area retailers, shop, um, supermarket. The products are also distributed in a variety of hotel and uh, restaurants around the world. In the World Cup, on Olympic game too. Okay, that's it. Okay. Thank you. Sorry, no podía activar el micrófono. Go ahead, go ahead, please. The last piece, place and promotion. Promotion, um, Coca-Cola's promotion strategy focuses on aggressive marketing uh, through and campaigns using media channels such as uh, television, online commercials, and print media. Um, Coca-Cola sponsors important events um, such as uh, American Idol, NASCAR, um, Olympic Game, FIFA World Cup, for example. Okay, and that way they uh, try to promote their brand. Okay, thank you. Okay, because of the time, uh, we are going to stop it here now. But so please try to get ready for tomorrow. But try to do it because when I ask you to participate, it's just because I know that is the one way in which you can improve yourself. But if you, if you don't want to do it, it's up to you. But I invite you to do it every day, every time, every moment. Okay, just let me check out the attendance.
Adriana. Ana Beatriz. Present teacher. Okay. Um, Ana Lilian. Present. Ana Mariela. Escobar. Present. Claudia. Francis. Iris Ibet. Jose Jonathan. Present. Juan Carlos Rivas. Juan Carlos Rivas. Laura. Present. María Concepción. Present. María Elena. Present teacher. Mayra. Present teacher. Zaira Eliana. Zaira Marlene. Santos Misael. Present teacher. Wendy. Present teacher. Jenny. Present teacher. Yesenia. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto. Present teacher. And Mario Ernesto. Present teacher. And let me see who's going to be today at the end. Number seven is Francis Elizabeth. Are you there, Francis? No? It's not here. It's not here. Okay. Thank you very much. Present teacher, no puedo activar esta cosa rápido. Ah, Saira. Okay. I, I wonder why. Okay, don't worry about it. Uh, well, today you got a lot of information about related with new vocabulary with the four P's and these different strategies. I hope that you can keep it in order that you can use it. And we are going to continue talking uh, tomorrow, okay? Pero por favor, uh, se lo voy a pedir de nuevo en español. Necesito que todos participen. Eh, no quiero solo estar dando información, información, porque algunas veces o la mayoría de veces, si solo el que está enfrente habla, los demás como que tienden a, a, a cansarse, ¿no? Entonces no quiero que solo estén oyendo mi voz, sino la de sus compañeros, pero debemos de poner de nuestra parte todos. Así es que se los pido, por favor. A veces son bastantes eh, diapositivas y sometimes it's, it's really difficult yeah, to be talking. In my case, for example, I start talking in, in, in the play where I work uh, from seven to, to four, and then I start another class that I have from six to seven, and I take a uh, a nap of one hour and I start with you again, you know? Well, for that reason it's necessary that, that you interact with me too. Okay, thank you very much. I really appreciate the ones that every class uh, try to give your point of view. Thank you very much. And that way I, you are showing me that you are doing something very good. Okay, good night and I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good night tomorrow. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night, teacher. Good night.
Teacher, we can review the, the, the subject. Ah, Mario, Mario. <laughs> okay, Mario. Quickly, quickly. I know. Uh, in, in, a, in a hurry, in a hurry. Yeah. Okay, okay, let me get into the platform first. My goodness. Ser el cansancio, ok, pero se me cierra la máquina, no mis ojos. If you want to, I can say, I can share my, 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 my screen, only to oh, see oh, it. Ok, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on a little bit. Espérame un segundo, quiero, quiero ver qué es lo que pasa. It is the same, 1.5, I guess. And you are talking about the number four, number five. Yes, that's right. And the number two and number five. And number two and number five. Hmm. Okay, show me your, your screen. My screen. No, no, it's not. This. Okay, number two, say it. Okay. Okay, I got it. And show me the the the, the another one, please. The another one. Bar prices, the low cost, either of a product. Okay. Stop sharing if you want. Okay. And, and you got some music there too. I have some? Some 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 music. <laughs> well, this is the TV. Ah, it's the TV, okay. Okay, in the number two. Be careful with uh, with plural. With plural, many distributor cells. No. No. Products. Let me see if if products. No. Hey, you got it. Maybe in the second is is something in plural. So it's... Yeah, the only words that you need to have in plural is, is the second one, right? Ah. Mm. What, what what about the period at the end of the of the sentence? Have it. I you, have you already got it? Yeah. Okay, show me again, show me again. I, I, I would like to see some. <clears throat> mm. 
bienvenida a todos estos cambios y que todo esté también como aprovechando los beneficios de escucha Okay, hold on there, hold on there. Okay, continue. Okay. Ah. Okay. Um. Uh -huh. I got it. I I I know where it is. The there is a mistake. I got it, but it is. What is the mistake? Okay, in it is. Um, go back, go back. <clears throat> okay, at the moment that you are using a uh, good brother, try, try to remember the order that you are going to to use it. Ahí está. Eh, solo eh, revisa la fórmula, la, la estructura, perdón, eh, de cómo va. Ahí está. ¿En qué orden va? Eh, hay una palabra que, que arriba a la hora de, de escribirla está, no está en el orden correcto. No está en el orden correcto. No. Yo sí he probado un montón de combinaciones. No, 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 no. But, but, but when I say that there is something that is not in the right way, cuando le dije que había una palabra, uh, me refiero a las que están en las plecas. Ajá, ajá. Donde hay varias palabras y hay una que no debe de estar donde está. De acuerdo a la estructura que tiene en el material. Okay, it's, 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 it's stop sharing, stop sharing, and I'm going to show you something. Para no darle la respuesta así de una, sino que la mire usted aquí. Okay. Then you move to connect the, the laptop. Uh -huh, okay. Take a look at this. <clears throat> Are you there? Yes? Yes. Okay, take a look at this. Can you see my mouse? Yep. See this. I'm not ready. Okay. <laughs> and now go to the platform and see the order of the words. Uh -huh. Ministros, if sería ministros, use. I have to pull the contract form, the contract form of Google. No necessary. Uh, Si no tiene contracción en la en la que tiene allá, no hay necesidad de que haga contracción, pero vea el orden, el orden de cómo están esas palabras. Solo vaya a Solo vaya a la última. Bid, much rare, low, lower price. Ahora observe cómo la tiene usted ahí. 
No, ahí me perdí. Ahí me perdí. Vaya, observe lo que tengo sombreado acá. Ajá. Aquí tengo Good Match Rather. Ahora lea la que tiene usted en la plataforma. ¿Cómo la tiene? Ahí, ahí la tengo. No, ¿cómo está? ¿Cómo se la han dado ahí? Aquí está un red match. Ah, entonces. Entonces. De acuerdo a la estructura, ¿cuál es la forma correcta? Al revés, much red. Más en mi vida. Mucho redes. Vamos a ver. ¡Ah! Me imagino que debe ser el mismo error entonces en la siguiente. En la de cinco. Could be, could be. Es que hay, hay que leer las estructuras. No, no. No, right there is different. The last. It's different. Yeah, and, and, and the number five is different. It's not the same. Yeah. No, no. No, el, no, el mismo, eh, ejercicio, no. No. Okay, uh, read it in the way that you got it. Léamelo como lo, como lo tiene. Okay. Many more companies will already become with great caption. Ah, ah. Okay. Uh, so de, de, de ahí tiene que buscarle otra alternativa. Otra alternativa. <coughs> Vamos a ver. Many more companies will already become the low cost provider. The low cost provider. Uh, the low cost provider of a product with great caption above our prices. Okay, thank you very much, sir. No. Huh? No. I, I say many more companies will already become the low cost provider of a product with great caution about a world price. Okay. I don't know what is the mistake here. Mm, maybe that there is something that you need to look for. I know what it is. Show me and I'm going to tell you. Something is missing. The periods? The periods? Um, no, 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 not the period. The Diosito? <laughs> yes, maybe. No, Diosito lo tiene. Okay, show me, show me what you got. Many more companies. From the low 
course provider. Okay, continue. The product with gray ocean of our prices. My goodness, where, 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 where is the mistake here? Again, many more companies. Many more companies will rather become the low cost hmm? provider, provider, provider of a product. Yes. Good. Good. Great. Ocean above bar price. Okay, let me see. Let me see, let me see again. Okay, go back again and I would like to see the last time. Okay. Any more companies? I'm there. Okay, could you, could you, could you read, it, uh, read, read it again? Lea Melanie, many more companies. Many more companies will rather become the low cost provider of a, of a product with gray caution. With? A with? with? With Después de with, great, great. Ah, great, great, and uh, G R I A C. About where prices? Okay, well, that is that, that that is the problem. Okay, <laughs> no, what is the problem? Yeah, that, that is the problem, and the problem here is. That in the instruction uh, is missing a a word. A word. Yes, a, a letter. I'm sorry. I'm going to I'm going to report this because uh, um, yeah because um, because it's, it's, it's not right with that, that we say with great caution about where prices. It's an article is missing. With? With great caution? With? An article is missing. With that great caution? No. With? No. It's with? With big no it's an it's an it's, a, it's an article that you you need a quantifier could be maybe you and the identify better mm, no teacher no 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 para que para que tenga sentido la oración uh -huh. But I see it with, with great caution about where prices. Pero en inglés tendría que usarse con. Y aquí entonces hace falta algo. Much. No. Many. No podría decir with many great caution. Many much. Otro artículo. I don't remember. Can I see? Que uno, uno se usan, uno se usan antes de sonidos vocálicos y otros cuando son vocales. Uh 
Ya le di la respuesta. Ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. ¿Cuál sería? A lot of... No, 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 no. La, dif la diferencia de ese es que eh, no se usan adelante de sonidos vocálicos y otros en sonidos consonánticos. Por ejemplo, ¿cómo dice usted uh, para referirse a, al singular de piloto? ¿Al singular de piloto? Sí. ¿El piloto? No, pero en forma como contable. El piloto... Yo digo, digo dos pilotos y luego el singular sería... Un piloto. Ay, ah, ¿cómo digo esa primera palabra que acaba de decir? Caption. No, ahí me dijo la palabra. ¿Cómo me dijo? A lot of... No, no, no. En español. En español, cuando le dije dos pilotos. El, el piloto. No, yo digo dos pilotos, es plural. ¿Y el singular sería? Un piloto. Ah, y esa primera palabra, ¿cómo se dice? Mm. Ah, pilot. Ah, ok. Ahí está. Uh, with great occasion. Ok, ya pensé que tengo que preparar nada, pero no sé. No, ya me dijo la palabra, pero ya, ya, ya se le fue otra vez. Ah, un, uno. Ok, ok. Oh. But, I, but I don't know how to put it in, 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 the, in, the, in the sentence. That, that is one that is missing. Esa es la que falta. Por eso es que no le da, porque no la tiene. En, en, en lo que ustedes tienen ahí no aparece el artículo. Entonces. Uh, ya, ya. Me comprendió. Yeah. En vez yeah. de que diga with great caution, aquí tendría que decir with. Uh, with a caution. No. Después, después de with y great, entre medio de with y great tiene que haber un artículo. No pasa en inglés. With a caution. No. Ya, ya nos olvidamos, nos olvidamos del ah. artículo. Hola. Ah, caution. No, pero es que antes de eso tiene la palabra great. ¿Qué es eso? No sé qué es. Grandioso, grande. Ok, el artículo debe de ir después de la palabra with. Ajá, eso sí, eso sí se ve en medio de, de with and great. Ah, entonces ahí ubica el artículo. Es que el artículo, ese artículo no lo recuerdo. No, y ya no me lo dijo en español. Es, um... Existen dos. Existe an y existe. Uh, only uh, only la, la, la. Ah, ok. Try, try that, try that. Ahora sí. Ya. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> never, 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 never but, it's, my life. but it's not your fault because uh, indoctrination is missing. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm going to report it. Uh, voy a reportarlo porque en la instrucción no, no aparece. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. For that reason, that, it's, it's difficult for you to, okay. To identify that. Yes. that, that, that did, did, that you, did you start sharing your skin? Okay. okay, thank you. I hope that you now 
make your own ideas about that. I did with, uh, uh, listen, I did, I help you with a great pleasure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I understand that. I, I, uh, I understand. Okay. 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 Bye, teacher. Thanks for all. Okay, okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye, Maria. See you, Maria.